So I have a new project planned over the summer um, um, and it's going to be re trying to recreate Arnhem in both 12 and 15 mil scale. So the plan is to build a sort of rough replica of um, Arnhem around by the bridge and as well as then um, create the armies that would have fought in that particular battles, which was part of Operation Market Garden. Now, over the next few um, weeks and couple of months, um, I'm going to do a, um, a series of videos where I project my, or my vlog my um, pro, um, project and my, how I go up, get on with uh, putting this together. In the annals of war, few battles have been as intense and complex as the Battle of Arnhem. Part of the ambitious Operation Market Garden, the battle aimed to secure a series of bridges in the Netherlands and pave the way for the Allied invasion of Germany. In September 1944, Allied forces launched the largest airborne air operation in history, dropping thousands of paratroopers behind enemy lines. Their mission was to capture the key bridges and hold them until reinforcements arrived. The most crucial of these was the bridge at Arnhem. Uh, the operation faced fierce resistance. The 1st Airborne Division, tasked with capturing Arnhem Bridge, encountered well-prepared German defences. What followed was a desperate struggle marked with heroism, sacrifice and strategic manoeuvres. Um, and in this project, I, I plan to do a bit of a deep dive into the Battle of Arnhem um, and look at some of the tactics, some of the challenges the soldiers face and some of the decisions that define this historic confrontation. Um, and I, I plan to uh, write, re, try and rebuild that particular area around by the bridge and explore some of the wargaming aspects of um, the battle of, of recreating that battle of all, um, Arnhem uh, and look at some of the sides that have fought there. Uh, so we plan to explore it from a wargamer's perspective. Um, we're going to look at some of the phases of each of the battle, analyze some of the key moments and try and get some insights into how things could have, may have been done differently that could have change the course of that particular battle. Now the plan is to create a both in 15 mil and, and 12 mil um, a war gaming table around that particular part of the Battle of the Bridge uh, and this will begin with research in historical maps and photographs to try and accurately depict that, that um, layout of that area in September 44. Um, and so the aim is to get the bridge and some of the, the streets that are nearby in your buildings. Um, the plan is to use um, some pre-made 15 mil um, buildings and some stuff from sort of like companies like um, Sarissa. Now the miniatures we're going to be using um, are going to be from Battlefront for the 15 mil stuff and for the 12 mil the stuff from Victrix. Uh, we've got the Bearborn infantry here, and I've also picked up the six pounders. Now, the six pounders from Victrix come with Lloyd carriers. Now, in Arnhem, they really used jeeps, um, and that was uh, for the, air, the airborne troops, that was pretty much the main vehicle. Um, was jeeps, so I need to try and get some 12, 12 mil jeeps from somewhere, or I just used the um carriers and, and their proxy for jeeps. Um, I've also started picking up some of the bits and materials that I'm going to be using. Um, we'll look at those in detail. We'll look at the miniatures in detail in uh, um, future videos. Uh, and that's the plan for between now and say September is to look at some videos around the hi history side of it and some of the, the actual, some of the events that occurred and some of the personalities um, of those troops that served there. Um, look at the miniatures and then look at some of the buildings and um, where we can get sort of from which manufacturers and, and things like that and where we can sort of try and recreate it as best we can in, in war game scale. Um, so that's all for this intro video. Um, next video I'll be doing will be look, taking a closer look at the miniatures from 
Victrix, and we'll do that in a week and probably next in the next video in the next week or so and then we'll look at some of the germans and then we'll start looking at some of the more historical elements of the of the um, battle in future videos well that's all for this week don't forget to like subscribe and i'll see you next time